Welcome back, back, everyone, to another episode of Acoustic, of Energy. Acoustic Energy. Yes, yes, and um, we want to just thank everybody for being here. Thank you. We're still looking for a new move for Joel. We're because... not. I'm good. I'm good. I have, I have one. That's... I'm going to bring it out soon, though. You... I'm gonna bring it so out. you don't need any... I never needed help. <laughs> you can create your own moves. The first one was all me. Got it. All Got it. Me. It wasn't the supporters telling you to move your shoulder. No, 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 no. You just did that it all by yourself. All me, man. Well, nonetheless, <laughs> for today's show, we're gonna add a little island flavor, a little island twist to our space. We're taking it back to my hometown, and we're featuring none other, none other than uh, my brother, Minister Thompson, Tyrone Thompson. We know him as Papa San. Remember Papa San? I remember. You remember? Actually. <laughs> Whoa. I don't know Wait what he's saying. No. So this is what and a lot of people don't even know that this is. I'm the Kirk Franklin song. Yes. Yeah, and you, I was just trying to see. Uncle Speck, respect it. Sir. Bless everything Wait. and bless up and down, everything around, everything. Okay. So you know there's some things I tell you never to do again? Yeah. Move them down and put this to the top of the list. Don't so ever do that again. That wasn't good? Like, I'm, I'm hoping they can not even show this. That's how bad this John, was. John, what are you laughing at? No, no, that was really bad. Uncle respect, respect, and respect. You're still doing it. <laughs> Sorry, so it, some of you don't know who Papa San is, right? Papa San is a world-renowned gospel reggae artist from the island of Jamaica. You may know him from that song, um, or God is an Awesome God, which was done by Kirk Franklin, and the song where he says, I can just... respect, respect, and everything respect. Yeah. You know what? That's probably what they hear, now that I think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, he's our feature for today. And of course, we have some other super talented guys and, and just overall people involved in this show. The Absolutely. first person that we have today, his name is Renwick. Um, he's a Christian reggae fusion gospel artist originally from Guyana, uh, moved to the UK, and he now lives in New York. He has a passion for living, uh, just living in his living his best self. He, his slogan is, live on purpose. Yes, um, he came from a broken, homeless space, okay. but he found a way to come out of his circumstance, and he's now a gospel recording. He actually just got signed to a label a couple of weeks ago. This is nice. my brother. He is probably one of the most dedicated, driven uh, gospel artists I know. But I don't need to say anything more about Renwick. Ladies and gentlemen, help me welcome Renwick. Uncle Ruspect and two spec, everything spec and everything. No. 
Yo, what's up guys? Shout out to Dale, shout out to Joel, shout out to the entire Acoustic Energy family. My name is Renwick. I'm the worship pastor here at Christ Tabernacle Church, but I'm also an artist. And um, there was a moment in my life just recently, uh, my very best friend died in my arms. And um, I got to the point where I didn't want anything to do with music, anything to do with ministry. I even questioned God's existence in that moment because I was so deep down in depression. But the scripture that really brought me back into the place of total belief and of, and of course having people around me that didn't allow me to give up, that was so important. But the scripture that really brought everything around for me is all things work together for good for those that love the Lord and are called according to his purpose. And because God's got a purpose for my life, I can't give up on him. He sure didn't give up on me. He went to the cross of Calvary so that I can live the life that he prepared for me to live long before I even talked about the life that I live. So this song is called You Cover Me. It basically talks about God covering you from things that you didn't even see coming. It's a vibe. It's a bop. And I pray that it blesses your life. Acoustic energy. God bless you guys.
Amen, amen. Yep. Thank you, Renwick. Thank yes. you. That, that, that song speaks specifically to me because I know that God covers me in spite of. And there are things that I don't even see coming up, and I know that my God covers me. 1,000%. 1,000%. Now, listen up. Today is, uh, uh, listen, today is extremely special because I got a chance to sit down and talk to Minister Thompson, a.k.a. Papa, Papa. Son. Yanka respect, two spec, and everything spec. You're doing, you're doing, I'm not sure. All right. All right. Bad. I'll stay in my lane. In place, lane. One lane. My lane, I'm All here. right. There you I go. got a chance to talk to Papa San, and you guys are going to hear some of what we talked about. Be blessed. Welcome, welcome, my brother, Minister Thompson. How are you doing, sir? Pleasure, man. Peace and love every time. One love. One love, uh, one blessings. love. One love. Yeah, we man. are so happy to have you. Here on the Acoustic <laughs> Energy TV program, we are elated. We're excited about having you here sharing in us with ministry. We actually follow your ministry a whole lot. You know, we've been in contact for a couple of years, you know, with the church in Florida and the family and everything. Yeah. So I'm it's so happy to have you here, man. So most people growing up know you as Papa San. Does, yeah. it, does Papa San of 1995... Is, is the visual of that person different from the Papa San? No. And, and do, when you think of the Papa San, are you saying, you know what, I want to be, be viewed as a different person? Or, or, or is it Minister Thompson? Which do you prefer? Well, uh, honestly, I have two different careers, you know, mm. and um, I a ministry. I'm an artist and I'm also a pastor, you know, and so... People back in the days, they're looking for the wrong Papa San. They're looking for Papa San from the 80s and the 90s. Ah, yes. You know, so they will bring back the whole thing back to me and say, you know, no much artists and people call me, boy, if I'm since if you come back, this artist dead, the artist then on a career, but I'm not interested in that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And so they're looking for the, the wrong person because I'm no longer that, that person. You're is not dead. that person. In, in, no, amen. I'm not a person. My old man never meet my new man. Come on. Never happen. Come it's on, impossible. You know, new creation in Christ. My old nature never met my new nature. Come on, come on. Listen. The only I, thing I do is with my flesh. Because I, when the Bible said, when you the Bible said, any man in Christ is a new creation, which is true. You, run, you recreate your spirit. So my spirit man, that new man inside of me, which have the nature of Jesus, and that's where the Holy Spirit lives in my spirit man, I've never met my old man. Mm. They don't know each other. Come so on. when somebody come the whole Papa San is a strange thing, is a strange thing strange to me because thing to you. no person don't know that person. So even though my memory will go back there, my spirit man say, I don't I don't like that life. I don't know that life. So my spirit man is saying, I can't live like that. I don't know what is that. My mind will tell me something different because my mind is not my spirit. Mm. My mind can have whole mindset. It can have all we are thinking. The mind is like a processor. You know, it memorizes everything that, that, you know, things from the past. So all those things that is in my mind, it just means that that is in my spirit. Because even though my mind might tell me the money look good, you used to sing those things. My spirit man say, but I don't use to that yeah, life. Exactly. Yeah, this is true. Because the spirit man, that is a new creation, have no bearing with that life because he have never lived that life before. Papa son. What people don't like, so we spoke to him offline, and I have to say he's a very smart, knowledgeable man. Yes, yes. I want to into say the thank word. you for Deep such into an the inspirational word. word. We truly appreciate you and your ministry. Yes, yes. I'm excited about this next person, though. So am I, man. This is hey, my brother. Anthony. He grew up on this island. I'm not sure if, if you know. There's only one. There's only one. But go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. My bad. He grew up in Falmouth, Jamaica. Uh, he's been influenced by island music all his life. You can hear his, you can hear the reggae and the mm. R&B through his music. It's beautiful. And he has a strong desire to bring hope and a sense of purpose to young people. Ladies and gentlemen, K. Anthony. Hey, this is K. Anthony. I want to thank Dale and Joel and the entire Acoustic Energy family for having me. It gives me great privilege to introduce to you the song God is Good. This song was written in 2009, I think, if I remember right. And this song is pretty much, it's a cliche known phrase um, where 
everybody will say God is good all the time. And at the time I said, I've never heard that in a song. And I think it would be interesting. And that statement is definitely true. God has been extremely good to me. Um, he has saved me from many things. Uh, one of them is that in 2004 or 5, I was held up at gunpoint. And I'm here. So I have every reason to be thankful. Yeah, God is good. Yeah, yeah. But I know it's better because it means so much to me It gives hope when I am down It gives strength when I am weak It reminds me who God is Yeah Enough time we fill with problems No one there to solve them When things are done, there's no way out Christ turns up and turn it around Turn your darkness into light Take your load and make it light and it's God is good. He opened up my eyes when I was blind. So I got to let you know. When I say God is good, you say all the time. When I say all the time, you say God is good. When I say God is good, you say all the time. When I say me happiness and joy all, 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 all the time he's given me hope when i was lost god god god, god is good he opened up some doors when i was in need so i got to let you know Man, I am excited about today's giveaway. It is giveaway, giveaway. You know what? It looks give like away. you're mountain climbing. What do you? Give I, no, no, I'm not. Even, you I'm don't not, like my no. new dance moves? No, I Le think... you don't like. Nobody likes my giveaway time mm. dance moves. No, I, there is somebody under that likes the mountain climbing dance moves. No. Giveaway, giveaway. No. Today's giveaway <laughs> is sponsored by Music Is Life. Yes, yes, And yes. what we are giving away today are these amazing shirts that were made by Music Is Life. Now, wait a minute. Aren't you a part of Music Is Life? Yes, now? I actually work very closely with the Music Is Life team. <laughs> and for those who don't uh, necessarily speak Patawa, the shirt says, 
Now go complain. And it simply means I will not complain. Oh, there you go. So there are speci uh, specific ways that you can win yes. one of these shirts. First things first, you need to be following Acoustic Energy TV on Instagram. So take five seconds right now. Go follow. Yes. Four, three, two, one. Perfect. All right. Secondly, you are going to write the answer to the question in the bottom portion of your screen. Now, anyone can win this. Anyway. You can be in Toronto. You can be in Alabama. You can be in Japan. You can be in California. You can be anywhere yes. in the anywhere world. Anywhere in the world. You can win this. Yes. Now. I have the question. You ready? I'm ready. Can I win as well? Uh, yes, you can. Just give me a free one. Give no, free you one. will not get a free one. The question is... Wait, wait. The B-roll. The question is, Dale Brown sings with a group. His group's name is Dale Brown and blank. What's the name of his group? Okay? Dale Brown and... Blank. You have now to hurry up and go and yes. answer. Ready, set, go. Growing up in the island, like myself in the islands, we know that the, the, the gospel music scene is not as big as the secular scene, right? So there are lots of Christian artists that really are just talented overall. So they, you know, they want to make it their, their, their livelihood. Um, what would you advise some of these Christian artists who are having... You know, they're having this battle, an internal battle. They want to pursue gospel, but the secular world is calling them. What, what would you advise them to do? I've, I've met a lot of people, band members and artists included, um, that I'm coming in and they're heading out. Come on. And I'm saying, where are you going? You know, where are you going? I'm coming from there. I think a lot of gospel artists need to be educated um, about what the secular life is all about instead of trying to play a role that they don't understand. So what I find with a lot of gospel artists, they are trying to portray a role and a lifestyle, a way of life, a way of doing things like secular artists, but never have the experience of it. And I think they have to learn from people who have been there, you know, and have some form of experience with what, what it takes, and then know how to make the necessary adjustments. So I find that many times, you know, we want we want the fame, so we have to have the pose, we have to have the profile, we have to have the bling, we have to have all of these things to mm. for people to recognize. But in the kingdom of God, it's never like that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? The world is was like that. Because I remember when I signed a record company back in the secular, you know, the the, the first thing a record company gonna do with you is brand you. Brand. They're gonna make you a product. Exactly. They're gonna brand you. So then the girl, you have to put on a little bit more on the back and the back area, you have to kind of pump the lips up. They have to kind of put on some more here and there. And they mm. tell the man, put on some back and get some tattoos on. Move like a tug, act like a tug, behave like a tug. So people who grew up in decent homes just break out like, ah. you know, like they are tug just to wow. keep the profile. So the whole of that life is a profile and a fake. A lot of it is a fake. And so you find enough people act like, be like in the secular world just because of branding so that the record company can sell you. But then you look at their lifestyle and how they were, Brought up. No of them came out of Christian homes. Bonnie so you'll find the same thing. Yeah, Bonnie, so you'll find the same thing now with the gospel artists. They want to be a famous artist and then say, okay, let me see if we can look like that secular artist, act like mm. that secular artist, mm. prove like that secular artist. And then the Christian community is going to embrace me. And it fail mm. Because what they feel to understand is that one is the world and one is the kingdom. You understand? Mm. One is in darkness, one is in light. One is where you serve God, and the next one is serve man. Come on, and Pastor. And so, so you have to know differentiate one from the other. And so when you're in the kingdom, you have to move the principle of the kingdom. God, the Bible says promotion don't come from the from just the east of the west, it comes from the Lord. So how are you gonna be promoted without it come from God? Number two, the Bible says, humble yourself under the mighty hand of God, and he will exalt you in due season. So if there's no humility, mm. you can't exalt because humility comes before promotion. Secondly, thirdly, you have to know the word of God to sing about God. If you don't know the Bible, how are you going to sing about what you don't know? Come on. And so, so a, a gospel artists need spiritual guidance, need spiritual leadership, mentoring, and they need to understand the Bible and they need to operate in this principle. As the Bible says, seek ye first the kingdom of God. Then all these things shall be added. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct pleasure 
an honor to introduce this next artist, this next video. Many people may not know who he is, but you're gonna find out today. It is my pleasure, my honor, we are gonna be having a, a world premiere for this video on this international stage. Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I give you Dale Brown's video release, Mina Gagumpia. Tana. Tana, tana. Don't watch the hype, pana. Pana, pana. Enough how we a struggle and enough how we a fight and we can't get a bite. Ha. We nah lose hope, no. nah lose we drive. No. We nah stop try till we dream come alive. See that's okay, that's alright. Cause my God will step in. Me nah go complain. Yeah. No matter what the people say, me nah go complain. Nah go complain. Nah go complain. Get yeah. down on my knees and pray. Me nah go complain. The system now go my way, me now go complain. I feel work hard. Work hard every night and day. Hey. I was born in the island, yeah. And now I'm living in a strange land. But I will never ever stray from the original God plan. See everything have a season. And everything happened for your reason. So trust the most high, everything alright. Go on, holy faith. Me now go complain. This is the time to know that God is in control. Please don't let go. yourself today than you were yesterday. Complaining now, nah, make it get no better. Me now go complain. No matter what the people say, me now go complain. I get down on my knees and pray. Me now go complain. Though the system now go my way, me now go complain. Work hard every night and day.
You know the path was. So I got, I'm just hoping you don't cuss in this whole segment. <laughs> Yo, don't lie. Video? It's on point. Hey, I don't man. know. Wow. All right, cool. Oh, um, wait, wait, wait. Come no, again. No, no, I missed it. I missed it. There you go. Good uh, job. Quality is very. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Who the, did that for you? The production was well done. Those guys are really, really good. Who? Who, who was that? There's, there's some guys. And, uh, <laughs> some guys I know in Toronto. You know, we would like to thank uh, Sean Barrow, uh, yes. was the video editor and director. Patrick Walton as well. Um, Elise Beckles as well. Um, our Acoustic Energy family. Yes, it was is... definitely done by the Acoustic Energy family. So, I have a question for you. What do you listen to when you are going to the gym? It depends. So some days it's like Jada Kiss. Some days it's Soka, like tiny. Like there's some songs. I'm not going to start singing the songs right, <laughs> right now. Okay. I caught myself. Me too, me too. Sorry, sorry, folks. Sometimes, I sometimes I listen to like uh, Chronics. Mm -hmm. Or sometimes I listen to like high energy techno. Bam, dun, 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 dun. No, no. All right. What if we could find songs that were still gospel songs okay. that kind of gets us pumped up to just work out. You know what I mean? Because be everything, songs fit different spaces, Absolutely, right? And, and I think sometimes we're afraid of anything that reminds us of, you know, what we think is not appropriate. But we listen to it, right? Absolutely. What if we could find a song that allows us to just get pumped up but still has a word? That's like a win-win across the it. board. I'm here for it. As I'm am I. So this next song mm -hmm. will do just that. Let's go. This is Minister Thompson, a.k.a. Papa Son, featuring the truth. Ladies and gentlemen, stay tuned. So I'm trusting us on chariot. We trust another true and living God, you know? Yeah, let's go! Man, I step up, you know, said that them can't talk to yeah. we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. Yeah. Man, I step up, you know, said that them can't talk yeah. to we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. Man, I step up, you know, said that them can't talk to we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. Man, I step up, you know, said that them can't talk to we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. No matter where they're coming from, give me the Bible, give me the Bible, give me the Bible in a man. What if I step into a little bit faster? Don't bother with the crime and disaster. Who is it? No, pretty bit, pretty bit, pretty bit, tower, Miss Tana. Cross a couple of weekends, run, say, what's up, Bamba? Mother said, you're worried that you're my devastation. You're coming to the bottom of the river, 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 you're
Man, I step up. You know, said that them can't talk to we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. Man, I step up. You know, said that them can't talk to we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. Man, I step up. You know, said that them can't talk to we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. Man, I step up. You know, said that them can't talk to we. Turn the flame up and take it to a hundred degree. Guys, that had me running circles around my home. Acoustic Energy is an online platform that aims to create a safe space for artists to share their stories, showcase their gifts, and express love to our creator in a global space. We are dedicated to helping improve our community through the arts. And this is why we rely on donations from viewers just like you. Your donations go towards helping us purchase equipment and fund the operation of this growing organization. So how exactly do you give, you may ask? It's simple. We invite you to send a donation using e-transfer or cash app to give at acousticenergy.tv or visit us on our website, acousticenergy.tv, under the button Give. And while you're there, it'd be great if you could subscribe to our YouTube channel. Together, we can continue to make AE an amazing reality. I, I've, I've heard you in person a couple of times, and I've actually been to church and I've seen you preach. Um, let me go back to what I've seen on stage. I remember going to a concert in Atlanta and everybody was anticipating and they were ready for Step on the Enemy and they were ready for all these songs, gospel reggae songs. And I watched you shift the whole atmosphere from a jump up concert to more of a worship setting. And then you came back to the song. So here's my question to, do, to you, right? A lot of people state it, I hear it all the time, that Minister Thompson is a relatable pastor, like... It's easy to understand, easy to con connect with him. Okay. Yeah, it's easy. You got you have to be yourself. Come you on. see, this is the in Christianity that we have to we have to we have to get rid of because you know, people want to take you out of your zone and put them in a freedom zone and want to label you the way they'll see it fit for them. You know what I'm saying? And mm. so this is why you're having this problem. I was talking, you're talking to a person ordinary and then the phone ring and all of a sudden, hello, how are you doing? Mighty man of God. <laughs> and your vocal change and your vocabulary change. Hallelujah. God bless you. You put on this whole thing on this whole show. That's fake. Just answer the phone. Hey, what's up, bro? Everything good? Answer the phone, man. Be real. If you're going to preach your personality, be real because God loves real. Why David was a man of God one heart? Because he was real. Not because David was trying to live like a Pharisee. He was just real. He go to God and say, create in me a clean heart. <laughs> but you see, you know, you know, when you are right spiritual than me, I am wrong. I have sinned again. David was real. Him tell God, listen, I own the sin against thee only. That's what he said. Enough. You know? I have acknowledged. He says, against the only of I sin, creating me a clean heart. He was real. God loved that. God loved when you come to him and tell him exactly what is on your heart. What you struggle with, just say, God, I was a hypocrite last night, to be honest with you. It wasn't right. And what I did was all was awful. And I'm asking you, I don't want to do that no more. Help me. I'm weak. God wants people who are real, don't like faith. That's why Jesus had an issue with the Pharisees. Because they're wearing Christian clothes. But wolves in them clothing, but the clothes of an wolves put them on. And so Jesus never could deal with that. And so he treat them a certain way to let them know that's not all you're supposed to live in call them hypocrites. You know, for people come and they said, Oh, you should be like this, be like that. I said, listen to me. The Lord make sure the Lord already showed me that already. You 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 can you know you don't have to be the next DDJs. 
Come you on. don't have to be the next right. God, let me tell you why. Every person that God sent to me in the ministry, God will never send me anybody that I can't teach. So if you come through the church door and you feel like I can't teach you, I'm not your pastor. In the wrong house. Right where somebody can so every person will come to do i don't care if it's a minister a pastor or a leader or anybody if you walk into our ministry and i cannot teach you or correct you i am not your pastor mm. so i don't have to be the next td jakes because whosoever god will send to me he might already equip me to give to them so i don't have to put on a show to be like td jakes or another pastor to suit an audience i have to that also ever got sent under my care as a shepherd, you know, as a shepherd over his flock, as a pastor over his people, then any person who come in my pathway, I must, I will have to teach, I will have to correct and counsel. Come on, come on, listen, man, I, I was anticipating what our little interview was going to be like, but I could never have anticipated this. You, you shed light, you... You left a word with us for all of our listeners out there. This is Minister Tyrone Thompson, Papa San, who we know, the gospel legend, the musician, the father, the preacher. Um, we are happy that you were here with us today. Now, a lot of people don't know, and a lot of people do know. My question to you is, is there any new music that is coming up? Is there any music that is just like on the brink, like just release, or any new music that you want to tell us about? Oh, there's a lot. We have a lesson that is doing good, doing good. You know, it gets some play in Africa. It was done one in England recently. The album lesson that we just finished up, which is my eighth album, it's really a, a solid album, a solid album. And it was a long awaited album as well, because my last album was 2060, actually. So it's a couple of years. I never spent that long of a time without Wait. doing an album. Yes. The, the fan base is faithful, honestly, and they don't leave me, but I've never spent that long amount of time without doing an album. <laughs> a lot of things that's Toronto, sir. That's one of my favorite places. You know, I always to come and, and do ministry. It's been a while, but when everything everything's so clear up, you know, we're gonna be on the out there again. Most you know, definitely. There's so many events there, but you know, all of our events this year has been cancelled. Yes, because yes, of COVID yes. nine. Exactly. I should, I should have been a couple of times already. You know, what I mean, but we give God praise. You know, God, God is faithful and He's amazing. So we're looking forward. Hello. All, all right. Be with I know you all are hearing this conversation between Papa San yes. and Dale, uh, which really I think is a very powerful oh, conversation. Extremely powerful. Um, and right now, uh, Papa San has a specific message for our Acoustic Energy uh, family. Yo, this is Papa San. Blessing to you all. Give a big shout out to Dale and Joel and the Acoustic Energy family, One Love and God of Remember, my new single drop called Lesson. You know, it's a song that, you know, I, you know, it's a, I show you my life story and sharing part of my testimony and my life experiences. And I know it can be a blessing to many others out there as well. I remember for 2021, keep your head up high. You can do all things through Christ. You know, keep your focus. Don't be distracted by anything. Don't know when Jesus Christ is on your boat, you can smile at the storm. We love you. One love, blessing, God up, every time. It's not over, who tell you say it's done? I learned my lesson now, I learned my lesson now. Leave them flying like a bullet from a gun, yeah. I said I learned my lesson now I learned my lesson now Oh, we take it easy, I'm a general A life man, a push on a material I hustle them, I hustle for the capital But I pay in medicine, I want a bigger than your capital 
We don't need no segregation, frustration, divination. Child molestation destroys so many nations. Seek the Lord Almighty, get some deeper meditation. Read the word of God and get some spiritual revelation. Be work for the kingdom, so many work in a plantation. Go to slave driver, call the Lord is my salvation. Ultimate provider, he made the will of your creation. Pour down your blessing from generation to generation. Me don't steal from nobody, so many live in a police station. Me don't walk and look beyond me, so many run from confrontation. For me to live is Christ coming, know my destination. Sit in the different places, come and believe the rest. Resurrection, blood was sanitation, purify in the nation, no condemnation, redemption, celebration, no vain reputation, accept my abbreviation. Me walk in a godly wisdom greater than your education. Some said I'm a gangster, but I'm a agent for Satan. Sacrifice the idol, hopeless, you try to pay God. Them sell out for vanity, principality, and operation. We can't say every assignment, demonic participation. Sexual immorality and child molestation. Flee from such behavior, don't give in to temptation. Sin has sin, God in the priest, righteous indignation. Jesus paid the all. No way more for man redemption Some of them don't think what pill Every time in a puppet fit promotion In a one spoon of water And them till they in the ocean Them can't tell the difference Between the 19 and the motion Spreading them gangrene Like cup cup of the lotion What do they get? What do they look for them But file an accusation But men not respond To them false connotation Cut off relation Spiritual amputation Keep your light shining Me youth It's not over Who tell you say it's done I learned my lesson now I learned my lesson now Leave them flying Like a bullet from a gun Yeah I said I learned my lesson now I learned my lesson now Do oh, it take it easy, I'm a general A life man, a push on a material I also them also for the capital But I pay medicine, no one I'm bigger than your cafe now Do oh, it take it easy, I'm a general A life man, a push on a material I also them also for the capital but I pay medicine, no one bigger than your cafe now. Cause I surrender all. Oh, I surrender all. Yeah. I surrender all. I surrender all. The end of an amazing yes, program, yes, my guy. Yes, thank you. Minister Thompson, stop. Stop, stop. No, I'm serious. Don't ever do... So I'm going to do your, your cherry or your mountain climbing when I Yeah, dance? you can do my mountain no, climbing. Of course I can do that. <laughs> A big thank you to everyone that came out today. Thank you to Kay Anthony. Thank you to Renwick. Thank you to Papa San. Thank you uh, to Dale Brown. <laughs> My guy. Minister Thompson for being a part of this show, Acoustic Energy. Um, feel free to follow us on Instagram and Facebook if you are not already doing so at Acoustic Energy TV, everyone. Again, that's follow us on Instagram, on Facebook, and Facebook, rather, at Acoustic Energy TV. And if you would like to be a sponsor for our show, please send us an email to AcousticEnergyTV at gmail.com. And the same thing, if you'd like to have a birthday shout out, we're going to do them at the end of every month. So make sure you get your birthday shout out in. Send us an email at AcousticEnergyTV at gmail.com. And also, you probably saw it earlier. If you didn't get a chance to, feel free to check it out again. We do have a segment in our show where you can donate to this cause, to this ministry. Give at AcousticEnergy.tv. And that's if you're locally based here uh -huh. in the GTA or anywhere in Canada. But if you're not in Canada and you would like to donate to this amazing, God-blessed group of people... <laughs> and slash ministry, Acoustic Energy. You can do so using Cash App, which is give at Acoustic Energy TV again. So I know my phone is going to ring after when this is done saying, well, Joel, why weren't you a part of the conversation? So let's just get this out of the way from now. Well, it's clear you don't speak that language. <laughs> so They we... heard you. They should have heard you. You know what? Say D. All, right, all, right, all right, cool. No, no here's you know what you do. Here's what I you think do. I was going to figure out why we're going to now. Please say the first part of the, um, the song with Papa San and Kirk Franklin. Okay, so why don't I do this? I'm going to leave with that. But I'm just going to no, leave. No, 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 no. Say that Anka part. Uncle Respec and Two Spec, everything Spec. Who is Uncle? Spec. There are no uncles in I it. I said Anka. Who is Anka? Patois. No, it's Whoa. not. <laughs> Get to know your Patois. <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, have a good night. Rhythm! That's wrong. <laughs> That's wrong. That's all wrong. How can it be wrong? Is what is it? See, Anka respect to no, respect and everything. No, I don't even remember like, what it is. Anka, trust me, it's Anka. It's not Anka. Bro, I can play it right now. It's Anka. It's not Anka. It's Anka respect and two spec and everything spec. Uh, uh, respect and respect and everybody blessing, no God blessing, no God blessing, no God blessing. Bossy place, bossy place. Anka spec, bossy spec. Anka spec, respect. No, no, no. Pause, 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 pause. No, it's Anka. That's why he says Anka spec, okay. respect. Poor spec in every aspect. Well, if he wanted to say that, he should have said that. He said Anka spec. What should he have said? Anka spec, two spec, and everything spec. Joel, Joel, what, Joe, what were you supposed to say? Joel, what were you supposed to say? Ankle spec? Hey, ankle spec? Head spec? Neck spec? Shoulder spec? Foot spec? Where are you from? My mic is off. <laughs> <laughs> Joel, what's it? Anka. You really Anka. think it's Anka, don't you? It is Anka. <laughs> it's Anka. Anka. You it's... just made that up. No, it's... It's just, oh, let me find the, let me find the word that sounds closest to It's Anka spec, Bro. respect in... Anka spec, Anka spec, two spec, everything. Then, why is he doing this? Can somebody please stop him from this? No, no. You know you're married okay. to a Jamaican. Okay. show me, show me, show me. Show me the words. There's no lyrics for okay, that. So how often do you know the lyrics? Because I am Anka Jamaican. Spec, and two it's, spec and it spec. is... Ankle spec. Okay. Respect. What is ankle spec? Your ankle. It, it means it means respect all over your uh, body. Uh, uh, then we say respect all over, not ankle spec. No, no. Girl. Who says respect all over your body? You have to who say. Who says ankle spec? Ankle spec, respect, head spec, neck spec, and every aspect, and who God bless no so, one curse. No, so belly spec too? Yes, but. Well, it's anka. No, it's. You know what? I'm leaving. I'm leaving this shit. Because now I'm. I'm lucky, Vex. <laughs> Why does he not know? <laughs>